Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing well. Anyways, are you looking for a budget gaming mouse that's great in performance and moreover, it is wireless? Well, you're in the right place because in this video, I'm going to review this gaming mouse that I just bought a few days ago, Logitech G305 Lite Speed Wireless. The mouse was released around 6 years ago, but is it still worth it in 2024? Let's find out. First, let's unbox it. Inside, you will get the manual paper and the warranty card. Then this is the adapter cable. One AA battery. And the mouse. So, this is the look of Logitech G305. The body is all made of plastic, the sides are slightly textured, and the top is super smooth. Two buttons on top, scroll wheel, DPI adjustments button, and two extra buttons on the side that you can customize in Logitech G Hub. The design is very simple, no RGB likes anywhere, only a tiny dot of light under the DPI button. Even no power indicator light. But don't worry, you will get notified when your battery hit 15%. The top cover is removable. This is where you find the battery slot and the USB receiver. Usually the removable cover is on the bottom part, but for this mouse, it's located on the top. This mouse is so light, you can check it out on the website that it only weighs 99 grams. And the dimensions? Not too small or big, which makes this mouse pretty convenient to bring anywhere. It can fit inside your bag or even inside your pocket. And the sensor? This mouse comes with Hero sensor. It's been used on other light speed mice already, like the Logitech Pro and so more. And as you know, it performs fantastically well for gaming. The Hero sensor delivers exceptionally accurate and consistent performance with your smoothing filtering or acceleration from 200 to 12,000 dpi and can save up to 5 profiles with up to 5 dpi levels with individual colors. Now for the battery life, as we are told, it is also able to turn itself off between 1 milliseconds increments to save on power. That's pretty cool, which is why this mouse can last up to 250 hours or around 10 days of continuous operations on just one AA battery. Or it can also be adjusted to last up to 9 months of typical use in endurance mode, which can be selected via Logitech G Hub. I'll make another review video after 9 months of use. And you know what's more great is that with all of those features, this mouse only costs around $30 now, which is a great deal for me. And so much cheaper compared to the Pro or the brand new G309. When I use it for gaming, even though it is wireless, the connectivity is very stable I must say. There's no jitter and the glide is very smooth. It's like using a wire mouse. Yeah, I feel comfortable using this mouse. The only drawbacks is that this mouse doesn't build in Bluetooth. Overall, I love it. The price, battery life, wakes and performance, all of it are great. I would say 9 of 10 for the budget mouse category. I can say that this is the mouse that I can totally use for gaming or daily use. So if you're looking for budget wireless gaming mouse with a great performance, I will totally recommend this one, Logitech G205 Flight Speed Wireless. And it's also available in 5 different unit colors that you can choose, but the choice is all yours. Ok, so that's it for this video, I hope you enjoyed and learned something new from this video. Hit the like button if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video.